Welcome back, officers of the Republic. Is your course on Underworld Police Chief AP Gaines. I'm joined by T Swag, aka T Not Swag, aka my partner in a crime and meme lord aficionado. It is the summer of 69th. You know what that means. We're trying to get to 6969 subscribers before September 1st. If that's something you want to be a part of, hit that subscribe button. It helps out the channel. Lots of good memes and helpful content. If that's not your thing, it's all good. T Swag, you know what time it is, right? I do. Let's Three. do this. Two, one. The summer of the 69th, and you didn't sing again. Now you have to sing by yourself. Go on the nope. spot right now. Summer of the 69th. Yes, sir, baby. Summer of the 69th. Get your cups to level 69 or 6969 GP, and you can help us out in the summer of the 69th. All right. So since we are both the – I'm the CEO of Capital Games and you are the CFO of Capital Games because you are T-Swag, a.k.a. T-Money, and you handle all of our financials, we're going to talk about the five locks for the next Galactic Legend, a.k.a. Kenobi. We have five. We are 100% sure that they are correct because we make the game and fund it. So when the requirements come out, I want you guys to come back and uh, comment here and be like, you were right. I'm sorry, T-Swag and AP Gains. I am not worthy. Please take my, my groveling. Right off the bat, and you helped me out with this one, Django. I think Django is a surefire bet. They had a big fight scene. They, it was an important part of the second movie. Obviously, I'm a young child. I said the second movie, so all of the old heads are going to be like, it's actually the fifth movie. Episode 2, Attack of the Clones. He had a big part, of course. I think, personally, that they're going to add a new game mode. Not hinting at vehicles but i think there's going to be some sort of slave one and django battle going on with kenobi your thoughts did you ever play the game uh shadow of the empire for n64 uh i think the n64 was before my time so no i have well, not I, well i'm as old as the hills so it was uh <laughs> it was right smack dab in the middle of my time and there was this game called shadow of the empire and i was i was a kid at the time so i wasn't good at video games i didn't know what i was doing and the hardest thing you had to fight boba fett which was fine. You could beat him. But then you had to fight his ship, Slave One. And that was impossible. Could never beat it as a kid. Maybe I need to go back and try that game again now since I'm obviously yeah. so good at everything now. But I think that is uh, exactly what you're talking about. I think that could be a really fun mechanic that we see in this game. Now, how likely is that? I'm not sure. But I do think Django is going to be here. I think he's going to be a uh, Relic 5 requirement. Mm -hmm. And then me to requirement number two i think is going to be commander cody obviously uh commander cody is to kenobi as rex is to anakin they're kind of the right hand men the leader of their battalions commander cody of the 212th of course yellow represent i don't care about yellow i don't know why i said that but <laughs> uh, i the right color i think <laughs> he's yellow right he's orange no he's yellow you're colorblind and so am i calm down let's get to the requirements Two hundred and twelfth battalion. You can't. Battalion. You can't really cap wrong. on my boys, Waxer and Boyle. Why are they not in the game? CG. Yeah. Orange. Yeah, I had it wrong in my head. That's orange. <laughs> All right. Cool. Well, I know Rex is blue, so I got you there. Uh, it's not purple. That would be good, though. All right, Cody. What do we got going on with Cody, my friend? I think he's going to be relic. Um, relic five. I think I'm going to go. I'm going to go three actually for him. Ooh. Clones, the clone sergeant. Phase one. That is a fantastic point. Clone Sergeant Phase One is at Relic Five. A little steep for my blood. You got Cody in at three. I got Cody in at three. But again, you know, Clone Sergeant Phase One. You know, I can't wait for that TV show. So uh, he's one of the biggest characters in the game and one of the biggest characters in the in the in the universe. So exactly, yeah. His lore is just fantastic. Of course, his uh, trilogy and Legends is some of the best reads if you haven't checked it out. Rivals even the Thrawn trilogies. Um, that brings goes us. It's two, everything. Oh, changes. phase two, man. Uh, once, dude, once he got to phase three and four, uh, they're starting to get phased out at that point. <laughs> I'm so funny and intelligent. He promoted past sergeant, he just keeps getting extra phases. He was kind of, you know, put to the put to the back burner there. Exactly. It was a little tragic how they did my man dirty at the end. But we have Maul in. Of course, we talked about on your video. Of course, I'll link your your channel in the description. I don't know when your video is coming out. I don't even know when my video is coming out. Life is so uncertain these days, is it not? I have Maul coming in. I think he's going to be a requirement. Um, I think it's obvious. I mean, we have GG, of course. Let me just open up the requirements right here. We have, of course, GG and a couple of other dark side characters because you need to go against Kenobi. You need to fight with Kenobi in the event. They need to show you the character in action. 
Um, I think Maul is a surefire bet just because they have a rivalry as old as time. Uh, he was yeah. the first Sith that came back. He killed his master. He killed Maul until Maul's hatred kept him alive. They fought until the bitter end. Any objections with Maul, or am I just so smart that you know you can't complain um, about anything? Leaning more towards B there for sure, but something I just thought about. Maul's hatred kept him alive. Mm -hmm. Padme's love killed her. So, mm -hmm. I mean, what's the lesson? Exactly. That's why uh, when I walk down the street and I see children, I just yell at them because I need to fuel the fire of my anger so that I can live forever. And because I'm going to need to live forever if we ever get a Galactic Legend Maul or Anakin because it's... It's coming, but not soon. All right, that leads us to the fourth requirement. You got this. Little green man, take a uh, shot little, at it. Uh, Mike Wazowski. From mm -hmm. <laughs> no, Grandmaster Yoda. Um, and I think it's going to be Grandmaster Yoda. We've seen Hermit Yoda as a requirement before, but Grandmaster Yoda is uh, going to be a requirement here. I think he and Kenobi have always had a special bond. Um, he was uh, obviously there for a lot of the events of the Revenge of the Sith with Kenobi. They were together walking the halls of the temple after it had been massacred they you know yoda knew what had happened but he shared the video with obi-wan you know he tweeted in the, the 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 viral video so to speak and um i think we're going to see him as a requirement here i think he's definitely going to be relic seven i think a lot of people have him relic already so this will be your chance to bump him on up to relic seven help out your jedi knight Revan team and uh get this new gl to boot yeah, I just brought mine up to Relic 5 as long, as well as a bunch of other characters because my guild won't stop complaining that I don't participate in any guild events, even the Sea Pit Raid. Guys, you can't you, you can't be expecting me to actually participate in guild activities as a member of the guild. I, it's a little ridiculous, um, but yes, I will get my, my Yoda up to 7 because I will be getting Glock, a.k.a. Whatever people want to call those losers who call them JMK. Ugh, I can't. Can you stand those JMK people? I can't stand them. They're so entitled. There's too many. Uh, there's too many like JMs at this point and Js, and JK, and just like I, I'm someone not, wanted I'm, to call I'm, them JK. I'm like, I'm gonna. I can't even like sing the alphabet without getting G and J. Can you, I, I can't say. Oh, okay. I got JK lead with GK and GMY yeah. and favorite QGJ. <laughs> Huge <laughs> gear to be able to to pronounce that with my mouth. Oh my god, that's a little ridiculous. And last, of course, we have drum roll, please. Unless you actually have a drum roll in your studio, that would be pretty funny. But we have Satine. Um, yes, another marquee character. I think it's important that they wrap up that Mandalorian faction. I think a lot of people have invested resources into them, especially now that the um, the Razor Crest is out. People have their Bams. People have armors already. People have Bo-Katans. Uh, I think I think it's important that we get a, a like a wrap up to the faction to help them be viable, especially with the new GAC changes, more teams at the higher levels. Plus, I mean, she's such an important character. We talked about on your video how Padme is an important character for a potential fallen Anakin. Of course, her being the father of his two children, uh, Satine being the father of uh, not the fa Satine being the mother of uh, of Kenobi's child. Uh, Disney make that happen. Uh, I think people are going to be upset there's another marquee, but I think it's in the end of the day it's going to help out the whales and the people who have been playing for a long time have those resources allocated to getting a character early. Uh, plus, she's just an important character in his arc, and I think she's going to wrap yeah. up the fifth slot. Yeah, I think so, and that leads us to um, to uh, my favorite theory of yours, which is uh, the ultimate ability of Maul, right? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, Maul's ultimate ability, of course, is going to be cutting off the head uh, of the most loved one of the opposing GL, of course, uh, when there's no GL present, the default is going to be cutting off Satine's head and then yelling, uh, you know, a myriad of things. We could get the Kenobi, or we could get the let me go, let me die, or you're all going to burn. We could get any of those. Uh, it's a little mix and match. It, it brings, you know, change to the game, a randomness, which quote, which character is going to get their head chopped off. But yes, yeah, Satine needs to be in the game so they can render her polygons for when Maul hits her with the slice. He's a, he's a dramatic boy, that's for sure. He is a dramatic boy. Uh, but that's why we love him. Any closing thoughts? And by closing thoughts, I mean this is the second time we've recorded this, and I'm really just praying to our Lord and Savior right now that the audio worked. Uh, of course, I will link your channel and the video when it comes out in the description, so if you guys want to check out his, that is where you will go. Uh Say something funny before I end this video so I don't feel like that. Uh... Everybody, everybody who made it to this point in the video, spam the comments with how tall you think I am. 
Oh, I know for a fact. Well, I can't leak it right now, but um, people people make fun, as a short king myself. People make fun of me for being five three, and it gets a little annoying. Uh, he's a lot taller than I am. I'll leave it at that. Thank you guys for watching. Of course, I love you, and I will see you next time.